Welcome back to the channel. Today is day 27 of playing chess every single day until 2000 ELO. Let's get into a game. So we're sitting at 1380, the highest point of uh, the series so far. And we get a D4, which I have said previously, my least favorite opening. And we're going to try the Dutch. Finally, in a rated game. I am not so familiar with it, but I'm trying to learn it. So here we go. He blocked in his own bishop, which is kind of weird, but I like to play the Leningrad here. I think you want to go d6. Trying to go here, and then if the knight ever comes here, it stops it from jumping in. This prepares something here, but we're not afraid. We're going to go here and bishop g7. And then we're going to be ready to castle. He's lining up a lot of, a lot of problems here. Defended pretty well. I think... E5 may be ready. Opens up the queen, but I want to castle first. We're going to castle. And yeah, so there's that. Now I can play knight b6. It's not knight b6, it's knight c6. Um, I just woke up like 30 minutes ago. So this is now not possible. Unless I move the knight. Which I don't want to do. I could slide over. That's possible. I kind of like just sliding the queen over. Because now I can always get out. Obviously I don't want to do this. Because then he's going to go like this. And... Oh, what's that? He's trying to break in. If I take here, it does open this up with a tempo on the knight. I don't think that's the best move here. If I take, he's going to take back with the knight. Not want to give me the bishop. Take, 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 take. He keeps sending emojis. <laughs> I kind of want to play here now. That was the whole idea. So if he takes, I take. Something like that. So let's go for it. Probably just going to take here. But if he does, then I have a fork. But he's going to expose the king. Really good getting two pawns, if that's the case. Ooh. I don't mind the position so far. I don't like, I don't like this though. He does have a very strong center. Uh, da, da, da. Decides to take there. Thinks probably what he should do. I'm gonna run into a lot of trouble here because then he's gonna take like this. And then my king's kind of a little Yankee. Okay, so he doesn't do that. I think I can take now. And that opens up the rook. Or I could move the knight. So that if he does take here, no, that doesn't work because he's got this.
I've always got this defender on that, I guess. Maybe if he takes... I take back like this, and then this. That. Okay, if I do move the knight, then I have this. So that looks, that looks alright. Where do I want to put my knight? Because this is the only option, really. Then my knight's kind of trapped. You can just play this, and this. No, that looks, that looks alright. We're, we're gonna go here. Now I want to develop my knight. Maybe I want to play b5 first. Just to control this square very well. And he's got various checks here. We need to be careful. So pushing c5 also doesn't allow him to go c5 to open up this check or this check. Which looks kind of strong for him. Okay, now he takes. Uh, did I miscalculate something here? Here. And then I just take with the the, uh, the rook. Okay, we're good, we're good. Oh, but then there's a fork. Ah, dang. Yeah, if I take with the rook, he goes here. Then can I sack the rook? Just wait a minute. So, rook f5, rook g4, or not rook g4, pawn g4. Rook, oh, that, no, he can't do that because then he hangs the knight. Beautiful. There'll be a knight for a knight. And now he comes in. Uh, this has two defenders, two attackers. If I go here, can't take. Oh, that just hangs the rook. We do not want to do that. Uh, this is hanging, and now he does have this. Let's try to trade the queen. It's going to make my pawn structure very... Well, no, because I can just take with the knight. I have this knight move as well. That... Well, wow. now this pawn is kind of weak, so we don't really I don't want to do moves like that. He can just take the pawn, I think. No, because there's this. If I move the knight back, then he can take the pawn. Assuming that he's like still attacking it with the queen. And he goes for this knight move. If I go here, he's going to take... I could just gain a tempo here. Because he can't take... Is there a way for... Oh, if I go here, he's just going to take, then take. Then he gets my rook. We need to move the rook. I think this, no, no, the bishop, the bishop, the bishop. See the whole board. <laughs> uh, da, da, da. Maybe I just come all the way back here. If I come here, there's no, no way for him to gain a tempo on me. And then when I move the knight, we can double up. He makes that move relatively quick. I do want to play this.
But I don't like how much pressure he has here. So I guess that's one way to relieve it. Can't go to any of those squares, so. And he might not take. He might want me to take. And now he takes the queen. So. We're looking pretty good, actually. We can gain a, another tempo here. Well, if I go here, where is he going? Okay, that's fine. And then we can double up. Or go to rook e8, maybe. Always an option. And he can't move this, otherwise he blunders a pawn. Yeah, it looks like we're going to go rook e8 and protect this. I can just double up on that file. Yeah, I guess we'll just double up here. Okay, so he wants to move this, but he can't actually move it. We're going to jump the knight in, try to go here. And then we want to push. We want to push P, as Hikaru says. Ah, he's trying to go here. And this move also stops that. Can I go here? Yeah, I can. Here, here, and then here. Or here if needed. See, my, my bishop is just so much better than his. Kind of dominant. Gotta take. Or move the knight. We're going to take like this, and we have checks here. Takes, uh, come in, and he's got to do something about this. Okay, maybe he doesn't, maybe he doesn't. Let's come on to the seventh rank or the second rank, I guess, for him. Now we have this check, but it's covered for now. Comes out. Ah, he's targeting my pawns. So we're going to try and put these on light squares so that he's not able to target them. And he moves the king to attack. Uh, da, da, da. Could trade. Then he has the more active pieces, which I don't like. Yeah, let's trade down. We have one minute on the clock. And if he doesn't move this, then I take. Okay, this isn't looking so bad. I guess that gets his king a little bit active. Nah, not good. Take, we're looking for this. He's gonna have to move. Actually, if he finds this, that's a pretty good. Well, no, because I have this anyways. Because of the uh, bishop. Okay. 
And he blocks it. Uh, da, da, da. We're going to force more. Now I have the bishop. And I don't really have any targets. Okay, let's trade down. Okay, we, we both have pawns here. We cannot lose it. I don't want to do this so that it's all locked in. But then my bishop's stuck protecting it. But I guess I can just kind of bounce around. I need my king over here. He can play h4. Or do I need to play here? Because if... No, the king can't come in right now. Okay, king stuck out. That's that's great. Great. I wonder he, if he'd take a draw. Let's offer him a draw. He probably won't accept because I have 45 seconds on the clock, which I respect. I wouldn't take a draw either. Especially not at our level. He's got the, uh, he's got the knight, which he can probably somehow like get in where I have the bishop like a dark squared bishop versus four pawns on light squares so and it's saying auto resign in 10 seconds so I mean I'll take a win if he's if he if this is the thing you know and <laughs> wow wow that's kind of crazy. I wonder what chess.com thought about uh, that end game there. I wonder if he was winning or if I was winning. No, it was just straight up a draw. Wow. He lost his advantage right there. That's crazy. We didn't play any blunders. We had one miss here, which was this. Why? Oh, okay, because I could have just, yeah, I could have just developed the knight. But I, I was scared of this. Why did it not think that was bad? Maybe because I could just, no, I couldn't. This bishop, bishop I keep forgetting about. Uh, it was a mistake. This is a mistake. That was a miss because, okay. Doubling the rooks was a mistake. I had a pretty good advantage here. Um, missing a, an opportunity to reveal an attack. On a pawn. Oh! Double pressure. So he could have took, but... Then I'm coming in. Probably with the rook. And... This was our mistake. At the end, because it wanted me to go here. Okay. Yeah, I think I think this. Oops, where is it? I think this would be a mistake because after the trades, my knight's on the side of the board and it's not very active. That's probably why. But uh, good game. We're sitting at thirteen eighty eight now and. Uh, I don't think we deserve that win, but I will take it. I'll see you in the next game.